Welcome to this shortwave radio channel and we're going to um, actually uh, give you some ideas of things that you can use your shortwave radio to do with. Now these are kind of top 10 ideas of things to do with a shortwave radio and uh, basically it actually means uh, uses that you know you might not think of that you know they won't talk about in the instruction manual but that you can use your shortwave radio to actually do a task with and today the first video that I'm posting is detect approaching thunderstorms yep if you have a portable shortwave radio you can actually use it to detect uh, and I'm not just talking about shortwave if you got an AM FM radio and an old AM FM set at home set it on the medium wave band or the AM band put it on in the empty frequency where there's no station and if the weather starts turning bad and you're wondering if thunderstorms are near well that will be your thunderstorm detector yep static crashes from lightning of course will appear on the AM band and as the storms get nearer the static will get stronger and so you can kind of have an idea is a, a thunderstorm coming if you hear slight you know static crashes in the background noise you know they're kind of far away but if you hear it really strong and even worse if you're listening to a powerful AM station and the static crashes actually overpower that station that means you might need to get inside and disconnect your you know uh, receiver antennas outdoors because there might be a thunderstorm really close or just arriving you know only in a few minutes to your location so AM radios and shortwave radios are great at detecting thunderstorms also because of the directional pattern of the uh, radio sometimes you can even pinpoint in what direction the thunderstorm seems to be coming from so that also might sometimes give you an idea is it a thunderstorm that's approaching me because usually they come from the west or from whatever direction or is it something that is you know um, not impending well you can sometimes use your radio to kind of detect and uh, have an idea of bad weather and especially you know if you're in the middle of nowhere in the forest or maybe you're camping and you're wondering you know the clouds look kind of a little dark and you're wondering if maybe bad weather is, is it a big thunderstorm coming well turning on your radio will have uh, you know give you an idea of maybe a thunderstorm is near if you do see dark clouds but have no static crashes well you can say that oh no thunderstorms it's probably just rain so uh, these are unusual but um, things that you can do actually with a shortwave or an AM radio detecting thunderstorms. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.